Oh no! Oh no! What quiz are we doing here? This quiz is fricked. What's up, Ozones? Welcome to the Ozone and welcome to a FNAF video that I haven't done in a while. Yes, I'm still a FNAF YouTuber. Definitely, I, I just do other content on the side. Don't don't blame me. I I I am an all rounder. Okay, I'm an all rounder YouTuber. I do things all round. Today, I want to learn a little bit about myself, and so I thought, why not connect me to a FNAF animatronic character? Am I Bonnie? Am I the puppet? I sure hope I'm the puppet. Smash, smash, pass, pass, pass. Pass, smash, pass, smash. Yesterday I have three quizzes to do and each of them are going to tell me what animatronic I am in Five Nights at Freddy's. And if I get the same result in all three, I'm going to be a little bit concerned. I feel like that's just going to be my destiny at that point. But uh, I shouldn't be too scared because it is all fictional at the end of the day. And these quizzes are absolute baloney. I'm sure I'm going to prove that today. Let's begin with a wiki how page. Now, usually I I really trust WikiHow because it's told me how to do multiple things like how to tie my shoelaces and how to get a girlfriend. And today it is going to tell me what Five Nights at Freddy's character I am. Um, Freddy, Chica, Bonnie, Foxy, almost 10 years, 10 plus games and a movie later, we're all still obsessed with the iconic mascots from this legendary video game franchise. But the question remains, which one of these not so innocent animatronics are you most like? Uh, hit start quiz to find out. No nighttime security job required. Picture that has nothing to do with Five Nights at Freddy's. Alright, I guess I'm gonna start quiz. What colour would you like to paint your room? Oh god, this is gonna be- this, it's gonna be so obvious which- like which answer corresponds to which animatronic. Uh, something bold like bright yellow or green. Moody like deep blue or purple. Earthy like orange or tan. Something simple like black or white. So, Instantly, I'm knocking off something moody like deep blue or purple. Can you imagine if this room was was purple? <laughs> it, it would feel so less spacious um, And so that's the reason I, I have quite a light colored room uh, and by light. I mean white I don't know if bold is me. I don't know if I'm a bold kind of person I used to have a bright yellow room, but I didn't like the atmosphere in there. I thought it was a bit sickly So I'm gonna be a really vanilla person <laughs> just, just really vanilla and be black or white What role would you take in the battle of bands vocalist guitar drums or bass? It's between vocalist or guitar because I play guitar and I sing while I play guitar so um you know, it's it's either the two. I'm really intrigued to see who who out of Freddy, Bonnie, Chica, and Foxy plays the drums and who plays the bass. Obviously, Freddy is the vocalist and Bonnie is the guitar, but drums and bass? Drum and bass? I wonder if we can get DJ Foxy on the deck. I'm gonna say guitar, just because it's basically the only instrument I can play. What would you like to dress up for as Halloween? Uh... I said that wrong. What would you like to dress up as for Halloween? Something cool like a rock star or Spider-Man? Something glamorous like a prince or princess or a Barbie? Something iconic like a Pokemon or an inflatable T-Rex? Something classic like a pirate or Mario character? Is a Mario character classic? I don't know. I guess, I guess so. To be honest, probably something cool. I don't know. I would, I'm... I'm the type of person to experiment. I do so many different types of dress ups. I've dressed up, when I was younger, I dressed up as Harry Potter. When I was much younger, I wanted to be a rock star when I grew up, so I dressed up as a rock star. I also dressed up as Olaf once. I don't know if I can get the picture for that, but that was genuinely awful. I, oh, I don't know. I would probably dress up as a prince, but like, I don't want to say something glamorous because I'm, I'm not a Barbie, I'm not, I'm not a Ken. Um, I'd probably go something iconic. I don't know! I would never dress up in an inflatable T-Rex. This is hard. I'm gonna go with something cool. Because, you know, I'm a cool person. I'm so cool. What's the best pizza topping? Absolutely pepperoni. But I don't- I don't mind pineapple. I just- I'm- I'm not a massive fan of pineapple by itself, so that's why I'm not a fan of it on pizza. But I- I can understand the craze. 
Which emoji best represents you? Skull and crossbones, crystal ball, sunglasses, fireworks. Uh, probably have to go with the sunglasses because of how cool I am. So there you go. What's your go-to snack at the movies? Nachos, candy, a hot dog, or popcorn? Really? I, I mean... Ah, oh, nacho. I, I love a good nacho. <laughs> a singular nacho. But I also, like, when I go to the movies, what am I eating? I'm 100% eating popcorn. Actually, I usually eat candy. No, I probably candy. I'm gonna go candy. What sounds like a perfect Saturday to you? Playing my video game, my, my favorite video games and taking a nap. Having a jam sesh with my pals. I don't have any pals, so. Having a sleepover with a pizza and scary movies. Going on an adventure at the local park. To be honest, sleepover with pizza and scary movies, probably my forte. I'm not an adventurous person. Uh, I, I like kind of hanging out and watching things together. I think that's pretty cool, so I'm going to go with that. I have no idea what animatronic is going to come out of this, by the way. It, it could literally be any animatronic, and I wouldn't care, first of all. I mean, actually, if it comes out with Chica, I'm going to care a little bit. But, uh, what beverage really gets you going when you're in the mid-afternoon slump? I don't drink coffee. I don't drink tea. What's the difference between soda and energy drink? Oh, I think energy drink is an energy drink and soda is just, yeah, soft drink. So I'm going to go with soda because I don't drink the other three. Uh, what prize are you angling for at the claw machine? The box full of candy, the monkey with the Velcro arms, the weird SpongeBob plush, the ball with the mystery prize inside. To be honest, probably the monkey with the velcro arms. <laughs> I just find that so stupid. Road trip time! What's your destination? The beach, a theme park, the big city, or a cabin in the mountains? Um, I practically live on a big beach. <laughs> Not really, but I, I, I can go to the beach whenever I want, really. Theme park, I couldn't care less about theme parks. The big city, a bit too big for me, probably. I, I like a cabin in the woods because I, I like isolation quite a bit. Um, I like to be alone. And also mountains are really pretty and I don't get to see mountains very often. Pick an ice cream flavor. Cookies and cream, bubble gum, mint chocolate chip, chocolate chip cookie dough. Oh, I'm going to be blasted in the comments for this one. Um, it's between cookies and cream and mint chocolate chip. I'm going to say mint chocolate chip because I think that's more spicy. Uh, so there we go. And then choose a mythical mystical creature. Dragon, phoenix, unicorn, or mermaid. I'm gonna go with the phoenix because I love phoenixes. Phoenixes? Phoenixes. Oh, that sounds a bit dodgy. And you are Freddy! Woo! 45% of quiz takers got the same result. So, so what they're basically trying to say is I'm I'm completely vanilla. I'm standard. I am average. I'm just like everybody else in the community. I am Freddy. What do my results mean? Iconic and unforgettable, you're the face of Freddy Fazbear's. According to the official Freddy Fazbear's pizza song, you're a chill, relaxed, and happy guy who just likes to have a good time doing his days of entertaining. What do you mean, according to the official Fa Freddy Fazbear's pizza song? Chill, relaxed, and happy guy. Oh yeah, I'm chill and relaxed. Yeah. What? Where does that come from? Although there's no way to sh uh, know for sure, some fans believe that Freddy is a pretty social and engaging bear who makes a great leader. Of course, this is all speculation, but some have gone as far as to say he has an MBTI type and star sign. Possible MBTI. Envj. I'm an INFP, I think. An INFP. Uh, so that's completely wrong. And possible star sign, Aries, Leo, Virgo. I'm a Sagittarius, so <laughs> this, this quiz is fricked. All right, but doing one quiz is not enough for me because I need to confirm if Freddy is the perfect match for me. I said that as if I'm doing Tinder, but I, I'm not. I, I just, I want to know who my soul animatronic is. My spirit animatronic. And so now I'm going to turn to a website called proprofs.com and we are going to go to which FNAF character are you by uh, Kayla Barfus. That is an unfortunate name. Okay, let's begin. Do you think FNAF 4 is scary? To be honest, FNAF 4, for me, scariest in the franchise, I think. Um, 
I thought VR was quite scary, obviously. Uh, I thought that Pizzeria Simulator look, staring down the vents in order to uh, repel the animatronics is pretty pretty terrifying, but I think FNAF 4 is, is scary, yes. Which one do you think you will get? I think anybody who says Springtrap here is a criminal. <laughs> I, th I think like, no, I don't associate myself with Springtrap. I'm gonna say Freddy because I just got Freddy in that previous quiz, so I'm gonna say Freddy. If you were mad at a friend, what would you do? Grab them, bite them, jump on them, or turn off the house power. Jump on them? <laughs> Wait, I don't, what? None of these make sense. None of these make sense. I'm not gonna grab a person if I'm mad at them. I'm not gonna bite them. Again, criminal. Jump on them is just, that's a bit far. Turn off their house power. It's gonna have to be turn off their house power. I don't know what, like, I, that's the best option here, to be honest. If you're gonna be mad at a friend, at least turn off their house power before you handle them. Who is more active? Freddy, Bonnie, Toy Bonnie, or Mango? Uh, why do I care? What, literally, you're, you're, you're trying to, uh, you're, you are gonna tell me what animatronic I am. Why are you asking me which animatronic is more active? What? Who's more active? Okay, well, I'm probably gonna say Toy Bonnie, because Toy Bonnie, uh, Toy Bunny really looks like, I don't know, Toy Bunny looks like he slash she goes for runs every, every morning. I don't, I don't really know why I feel that way, but probably Toy Bunny. If your friend complimented you, what would you do? Say thanks, compliment back, flirt, or say hi. Say hi? <laughs> hey man, I really like your hat today. Hi. It just seems like some of these questions are a bit flawed, I think. I, I don't know. I, if your friend complimented you, what would you do? Well, I would say thanks, but I would also compliment back. I would also probably not even take the compliment because uh, I'm insecure like that. <laughs> I would probably compliment back. Sure, I'd say thanks. I'd say thanks. I think that's the most natural thing to do. Which animal would you dress up to be? Wolf, raccoon, panda or bat? I think raccoons are sick. They're, they're so cool. So I'm gonna go raccoon. What's your favorite food? Pizza, hamburger, I'm a vegetarian, macro cheese. Wait, <laughs> wait, pe wait, what is your favorite food? Pizza, hamburger, mac and cheese, or sorry, I'm a vegetarian. You could have put like, what do vegetarians eat? I don't, <laughs> salad. You could have, you could have just put salad. You could have put pizza, hamburger, mac and cheese, or salad. But no, you chose to instead write an option saying, I'm a vegetarian. It makes no sense. It makes no sense. But for me, personally, pizza, uh, I'm not just saying that because this is Five Nights at Freddy's. I genuinely just love pizza. Uh, so there we go. Which two people have the least scary jump scare? Toy Bonnie and Mangle, Bonnie and Freddy, Marionette and Balloon Boy, Chica and Old Bonnie. What is Old Bonnie? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. So we have Toy Bonnie, Bonnie, and Old Bonnie? This, this, this is fricked. This is so fricked. I would probably say, well, first of all, Balloon Boy doesn't have a jump scare. Balloon Boy doesn't have a jump scare, but I think Marionette is the worst jump scare on this list, so I'm probably not gonna pick that one anyway. Mangles is probably more scary than most. I'm probably just gonna say Chica and Old Bonnie because I don't know who Old Bonnie is and I don't really care about, oh, oh, does it mean Withered Bonnie? Because Withered Bonnie is quite scary. Like the design design wise, it's quite scary. I'm just gonna go Chica and Old Bonnie because uh, I, man, I hate that Old Bonnie jump scare. Do you feel bad for Old Bonnie losing his face? Okay, there we go. So Old Bonnie is Withered Bonnie. Oh, that, that makes no sense. That makes no sense. But do you feel bad for Old Bonnie losing his face? Uh, a little. I mean, there's only so much sympathy I can give someone who is an animatronic rabbit with a kid inside who kills people. When you're alone, you would listen to music, watch TV, eat pizza, or practice a sport or instrument. 
This, this quiz is so difficult because all four of those apply. <laughs> I, when I'm at home, I watch TV and eat pizza. And then later on, I would play music and listen to music. So it's like, what would I, what would I pick it? I'd probably say listen to music because music is my life. So I just love listening to music. Describe yourself in one word, funny, intelligent, brave, or extrovert. I wouldn't say funny, I wouldn't say brave or extrovert, so I'm gonna say intelligent. I don't think that's a word that quite in, in, encapsulates me. I, I would say I'm genius, maybe. And let's re review my results. I got mangled, woo! I don't know what that was, I'm sorry. That was supposed to be a mangle impression. I just don't, it just kind of came out of me. Now this final quiz is gonna determine what other animatronic I am or whether I am actually Mangle or Freddy. And it is brought to us by uquiz.com by WolfGamerFX, fantastic. And it gets me to enter my name. Oh, how fun, Ozone. <laughs> oh no, oh God. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Favourite colour? Uh, there's a lot of choices here. So favourite colour answers, please choose one. Gold, pink, red, black and white, brown, purple or yellow? Um, options I like here. Gold, pink and black and white. Uh, I mean... Do people actually have favourite colours? Like, like genuinely, tell me in the comments, do you have a favourite colour? Because I, I wouldn't say I have a favourite colour. I have favorite color combinations, and when it when it comes to like the way I dress and stuff, yes, I, I prefer some colors over others. When it comes to the walls of my room, I prefer some colors over others. But like, in general, do I have a favorite color? No, hell no. Black and white is two colors for goodness sake. But I'm gonna go with black and white because I think like the the way I like to dress is quite uh, black and white. Uh, I as you can see, the walls of my room are white. Uh, I, I have, I was going to say white eyes, but that's not quite true. What are you like? Uh, fast, crazy, weird, spelt wrong. Secret, quick, or happy? I think I'm a bit cr crazy. Well, I, I'm a bit crazy and I'm a bit weird, but the thing is, I'm weird spelt correctly. What do you like? Secret. No. What do you like? Quick? I am quite quick. What's the difference between fast and quick? That's my question. I'm gonna say crazy. I'm a bit crazy, as you probably have witnessed today. Favorite food, cupcakes, pizza, meat, cake, cookies. Uh, this was created by probably a seven year old, I think. Um, no offense if you're watching this and you're not seven years old, but please learn uh, words. Uh, <laughs> wrong time to mess up your sentence, Ozone. Um, Favourite food, as we've said, I think pizza's probably up there. Cookies are good too, but sometimes I get a bit sick of cookies. Let's just go pizza. Keep calm and ship who you please. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! What quiz are we doing here? If you had a phrase, what would it be? It's me, you're dead. Dum dum dum. Da a a da da da. Want a cupcake? I'm going to take a bite out of you. Ah. <laughs> I'm so done with this video. It's probably just going to be... Wait, I'm going to take a bite out of you? That's so... Again, criminal. <laughs> it's just like, what? Okay, I'm, I'm going to go. If I had a phrase, what would it be? It would probably be dumb, dumb, dumb. Because that's what I am. Okay, let's see. Let's see my results. Your result, pop it. Okay, only thing you care about is you. Hang on. Where did you get that from? Only thing I care about is me. And, okay, only thing you care about is you and your child won't stop tell the person who killed your child is dead. I'm gonna share my result on Twitter. Okay, I, I really I really hope my Twitter followers enjoy seeing that I'm the puppet according to this.
well-made quiz. Okay guys, so we found out today that I am not only Freddy Fazbear, but I'm also the Mangle and the Puppet. Is that a good result? I have no idea. I don't know why I expected going into this video, but I hope you enjoyed nevertheless. Why don't you take the quizzes in the description below and let me know what results you get. Uh, and yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Uh, make sure to subscribe and like the video. And I'll see you in another one. Goodbye.